How's it? Today is March 19th. It's Thursday, and it's the second day um, I'm home. It, usually on Thursdays, I don't lift, um, but because of all the coronavirus uh, changes and scheduling, um, I decided I would lift today. I'll do my Wednesday workout today. Um, but because I'm still going to be planning to, to deadlift tomorrow, I didn't do any of the pulling movement so no um, RDLs at the end and then I also don't really have a place to do dips so I, I didn't even um, try to do dips today but um, yeah the, other, the only other thing that was changed was to kind of lower the rep range to twos instead of threes like typically I would do 10 sets of three plus one but today I did five top sets of um, two plus one to give myself some time to like maintain recovery for uh, tomorrow but yeah overall pretty happy with how today went setting up the platform thing here is a minor pain in the ass but uh, I am incredibly, incredibly, incredibly fortunate and thankful that my brother has this equipment um, for me to use. It's one of the better bars I've used in my life, so getting more time on it is really nice. Um, so when I get to my top set, I think it's like 216 or something. Um, that's because... All of our bumper plates are in pounds, and then our change plates are in kilos. Um, but, yeah. Um, kind of all the same things I've been trying to work on are what I work, we're working on today. Um, just basically maintaining upper back tightness through the extension. Uh, and then kind of extending fully with my, my legs. Uh, towards the end, I, I was saying stick to the bar to kind of elongate my pull and keep my body close to the bar so that my bar path uh, maintains straight. And uh, I think towards the end of the sets, I was able to do that better than um, the beginning. Here's my first set. It was kind of challenging. Uh, another good thing about today was that my back didn't hurt um, nearly at all. I've been trying to take care of that as much as I can, but I don't really have uh, a great way to ice my back here like I do at school. Like I ice my back every day at school, um, but I'll, I'll figure it out eventually. Another announcement came out today for the uh, COVID-19 situation with school. They have elected to keep spring quarter online for the entirety of it. So that means that nobody is expected to return back to cam campus. But because I am off campus, um, I'm not sure how uh, things will turn out. But I'll figure it out when, when the time comes near. Those two reps are really good. Maybe my best power direct there too. Uh, here's the set I sent to Steve. Yeah, I stuck to the bar on that one much better. I think something that's very important for these is getting the bar holding the bar properly in my hand so that I can get um, good upper back tension after the extension. And then here's my final set. That one actually looked really nice.
Yeah, and that one was a lot more challenging. But my last set. So, again, I'm pretty happy with how that kit turned out. That was a pretty good power drift. So again, I my note says that I was supposed to do some clean RDLs. But in light of the lifts tomorrow, I just moved straight to the pause front squat. I wanted to get more than 275 today, but I worked up to 275 and it was pretty challenging. So I kept uh, the weight there for four singles. I think I'm going to figure out a better angle um, moving forward. But for today, this was sufficient. My hip was um, hurting on the way down. So it didn't feel too great, but I was able to do them and uh, I kind of figured out how to adjust my technique so that things worked. Here's the first set. So two other things that are happening um, for, so well, let me talk about that real quick. So my hip shot out of the hole and I wasn't really happy with how that felt. Um, so I kind of worked for the next three um, singles to push my knees forward and not let my hips uh, go backwards. Yeah, and, then, and then they're just a lot better, they're a lot easier. But yeah, so, so the COVID-19 uh, what's happening now for school is school is actually going to be starting one week later. So instead of on the 30th, I think it's going to be starting on the 6th. And then um, there are no, there's not going to be a, a week for finals because they're going to make uh, final grades be based upon um in-class assignments and uh, learning throughout the quarter instead of just that one one day. Or, sorry, yeah, one day up for the final exam. After that, I did my presses. These are kind of um, standard three sets of 10. I have to look up there because there's actually a um, the garage door opener, like this, the, the engine not the engine the motor is there it's very close to the right where the the bar or the plates are hitting after that we tried to set up a um dumbbell to do some dumbbell overhead walks and the dumbbell is not very straight so walking here you see i'm wobbling all over the place um that's because the dumbbell itself is actually not even so if i put my hand in the middle it's not even so walking is a lot harder than normal and then to make matters even worse i'm walking on an uneven surface uh, in the grass so i think i need to either lower the weight or figure out a better system um, for the next time i try this if i want to continue my progress on the overhead dumbbell walk which i think is the single most important accessory I do. Yeah, so I only did about 65 for uh, 40 steps for only one set. Um, I'll figure it out in the future. So, yeah, that's it for today.